Hello everyone, welcome to Pabli Connect. Today in this video, we are going to integrate two software applications, Instamojo and Google Sheets. So the use case here is, whenever a new sale happens in Instamojo, automatically add new row in Google Sheets. Now let us know what these two software applications are all about. So Instamojo is a payment gateway and it is also a software application where you can set up your online store and sell your products. Whereas Google Sheet is an online spreadsheet program. The issue here is that Instamojo and Google Sheets don't have any integration between them. And that is why we are going to use Pabli Connect. So Pabli Connect is an integration software which will help you to transfer data from Instamojo to Google Sheets. The best part here is you don't require any knowledge of coding. So let me show you this on my screen. Okay, so here I am at Google and now I will go to this URL section over here and I'm going to type pabli.com. Okay, so this is the website of Pabli and now I will hover over this product section over here and I'm going to click on connect. Okay, so now we are going to sign into our account. So I'm going to click on sign in. Okay, so now because I have already signed into my account, that is why I am here. You can also sign up for free and create your free account in just two minutes. Here, I would like to mention one more thing. You can try out this integration in Pabli Connect absolutely free. So if you want, you can create your account right now and set up your own automation. The link is available in the description box below the video. Okay, so now I'm going to scroll down and here at connect, I'm going to click on access now. Okay, so now here we are going to create a new workflow. So I'm going to create a workflow now. Okay, so now I'm going to give a name to this workflow and I am going to name it as Instamojo Integrations. Okay, now I'll create it. Okay, so now in choose app, I am going to choose Instamojo first. Okay. So now in trigger event, according to our workflow, whenever a new sale happens is our trigger event over here. So I'm going to click on it. If you want any other trigger event of your choice, you can contact our team at admin at the rate and our team will help you. Now you might have a question in your mind that what is this term called trigger event? So let me tell you that automation runs on the concept of triggers and actions. It is all about when something happens, do this. For example, when a sale happens, send an email. In our case, new sale created in Instamojo will be our trigger event over here. Now when you choose a trigger event, after that you can see this term called webhook URL displayed over here. So what is webhook? Webhook is an essential way to get data from an external software at Pabli's end. So this webhook helps you to build a connection between the trigger software application and Pabli Connect. So after choosing the app and choosing the trigger event, what we do is we copy this webhook URL from here and we go and paste it inside the trigger software application, which is Instamojo in our case. So here you can read the instructions carefully and you can follow them. So now I'm going to copy this webhook URL from here. And now I'll go to my Instamojo account. So I've already opened my Instamojo account over here. And now what I'm going to do is I'll first go to the product section over here. Okay, I'll go to all products. Okay, so here you can see t-shirts. So I'm going to buy a t-shirt over here. So I'll just go to this actions over here and I'm going to edit it. Okay, so here you can see the title is here. If you want, you can write a short description. The picture is already here and the price is also here. Okay, so now when you come down here, you can see webhook URL. So here you have to paste the webhook URL that you got from Pabli Connect. So I'll just paste it over here. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'll just come down and I'm going to save the product. Okay, so we have successfully updated this product and the webhook is also set. Now I'll go back to Pabli Connect and here I'm going to click on capture webhook response. So now it is waiting for webhook response. That means now as soon as a new sale happens in Instamojo, Pabli Connect will capture the information. So now it's time to go to Instamojo and make a new sale. So I'll go to Instamojo and I'm going to click on this t-shirt over here. So this is the page of our t-shirt over here and I'm going to add it to cart. Okay, now I'll open my cart. 
so my quantity is showing here two i'll make it one okay now i'm going to check out okay i'll continue as a guest and let me change the details over here so first name is going to be austin last name james email is austinjames at the rate gmail.com mobile number 8109349123 okay address okay city is bhopal okay i'll just change the state madhya pradesh okay code is there okay so now i'm just going to continue this okay so make payment okay so you can see here we have a qr code available if you want you can also do a qr code payment and you can see we have all other options as well and if you click on more payment options you can see they have various other options available you can choose whichever you want here so i am going to do the payment through my mobile phone okay so you can see order is confirmed i have successfully done the payment okay so now i'll go back to public connect okay so you can see public connect has already captured the data amount is 9 rupees buyer name is austin james buyer email is here the number is here currency is here payment id is also here and if you go here long url you can even see the product url okay so i'll save it okay so we have successfully finished our integration of insta mojo and pabli connect here okay so now let's begin with our second step integration where we are going to integrate google sheets and pabli connect so i'm going to click on this plus button over here okay so now in choose app i am going to choose google sheets okay now in action event according to our workflow whenever a new sale happens in insta mojo we want to add new rows in google sheets that is why add new row will be our action step over here okay now when you clicked on action event you can see we have various other action events available you can select whichever action event you want according to your choice and if you don't get the action event of your choice you can contact our team at admin@pabli.com and our team will help you So now I'm going to click on connect with Google Sheets. Okay, create new or select existing credentials. Now if you have any existing credential like this, you can just directly click on them. But here I am going to click on new credentials and I am going to connect with Google Sheets. So here you have to select the account where you are going to create your Google Sheets. So I'm going to select the account. Okay, I'm going to allow it. You don't have to worry about your data with Pabli Connect. Everything is hundred percent safe and secure. Okay, so here you can see it has already mapped the name of some spreadsheet that I created earlier. So now I'm going to go to my Google Sheets and I'm going to create a blank spreadsheet over here. Okay, so first I'm going to give it a name, Insta Mojo Integrations. Okay, and let us create some fields over here. So I'm going to create first as name. email id amount last will be product url okay i'll just make these fields little bit bigger okay so now let's go back to pabli connect and i'll just refresh this okay so this is the one okay So now here you can see it has already mapped the sheet one. Here, if you go, it is sheet one, and if I go back to Pabli Connect, okay. So it has already created the fields over here. You can see name, email ID, amount, and product URL are already here. Okay, so let us map all these details. So first is name. So I am going to map the name. It is here, Austin James. Email ID. It is here, Austin James at the rate gmail dot com. Amount. Amount was nine rupees. product url if i go down here you can see long url so this is the product url we bought a t-shirt so i'm going to click on it save and send test request okay we have got our api response that means we have successfully finished the integration of insta mojo and google sheets here i'm going to click on save 
Okay. So now let's go to Google Sheets and see if all these data have been captured there or not. So I'll go to Google Sheets. Okay, so you can see Austin James is here. Email ID is austinjames at the rate gmail.com. The amount is here. The product URL is also here. Okay, so our integration is successful here. Now I'm going to show you this process again with one more example so that you can understand how this integration takes place in real time. So I'm going to go to Instamojo now. And I'm again going to buy the t-shirt, add it to cart. I'll go to my cart, check out, continue. I'll put the details over here. Robert Stanley. Email is Robert Stanley. Okay. I'll put the phone number. Okay, continue, make payment. Okay, so now I'm going to use my mobile for the payment. Okay, so we have done the payment and our order is confirmed. Now let's go to Google Sheets and see if the new data is captured there or not. So I'll go to Google Sheets. Okay, so you can see Robert Stanley, the name has come over here. The email ID is robertstanley at the rate gmail.com. The amount is here and the product URL is also here. So we have successfully finished our integration and our integration is working fine. So now I'll go back to Pabli Connect and I'm going to show you what has happened in our example. Okay, so in our example, what has happened is first the information came from Instamojo to Pabli Connect and then from Pabli Connect, the information went to Google Sheets. So now every time a new sale happens in Instamojo, a new row will be added in Google Sheets containing all the information regarding the sale. So we have successfully finished the integration of Instamojo and Google Sheets using Pabli Connect. Not just these two software applications, but you can integrate any software application using Pabli Connect. If you have any queries, you can contact us at admin at the rate pabli.com and our team will help you. For more, you can also visit our website at www.pabli.com. Thank you.